This program is presented by Design Singapore Council. There are few things more pervasive than design. Design affects what we do, how we do it, how fast we do it, and how happy we are doing it. To help us live, work, and play easier, an eclectic bunch of design leaders from Singapore have made great design their mission in life. I've created a world where there are no corner offices, where there is no hierarchy, but where creativity is king. You know, somebody once said that the opposite of love is not hate, actually it's indifference. So an annual report that comes across boring suggests that there's a the company is indifferent to, to, to its shareholders. So they don't just deliver power. The whole experience about drawing power, and even when it's drawing, how it stays there and look, is what we're concerned about. In this episode, our design superheroes set out to reinvent the straight-laced place we've come to call the office. In his own way, electrical engineer and inventor Yong Chun is also obsessed with mobility. But he wants to free up man and machine by tackling a very different issue, electricity. A point in a wall with three holes. Now this design, it's almost exactly 100 years old, and it's still in use today in exactly the same way. Three holes in a wall, in a particular place in a wall. Almost everybody I know hates trailing sockets all over the floor and untidy looking but nobody has done anything about it and thus began Yong Chun's design mission to literally empower everybody instead of a point in the wall we made it into a linear uh, socket so basically it is like a socket in the wall that gets stretched out in a linear fashion that's how we got the name Ubik it stands for ubiquitous what this meant was power could be tapped from anywhere and as much as you needed with a simple click and twist of a plug. More often than not, design revolutions come about when someone starts asking, is there a better way to do this? If the design team at Ubik had their way, millions around the world will be plugging in to a revolution. But first, Chairman Yong Chun and CEO Ju Kong had to figure out a way to turn this into this. Ubik's patented power outlet design wasn't one dreamt up from the air. The team knew exactly what they wanted to achieve and set out to design it. The marketplace was full of similar products, but none had a safety feature in their power track and a switch that works seamlessly with track design. Foresight and a prototyping facility propelled Ubik ahead of the competition. The prototyping is really interesting. You, you get to test out ideas. Uh, way, way before you, you actually put your first dollar into what we call a tooling or a mold. It's the, the window and the opportunity experience that you allow yourself to go through before you actually embark on the product. Through prototyping, the team could get immediate feedback from the marketplace, which helped them speed up ways to improve the track and switch design. And if you look at the key, this is the earth contact. And the earth contact first makes contact with the earth on the track. So it's the earth to earth, then the live and neutral. It took them 10 years to finalize their guarded sentry system, but the end result was worth it. A power outlet that is safe and easy to use. Just push and turn. Over at the test labs in Ubik, design developments are going on at an electrifying rate. But at the start, they had to solve one killer problem. How to create a safe product when others before them had failed. Conventional power track, they don't have the patented features that we have. In fact, uh, it all boils down to what is in between 
the electrical conductors. When you have a big gap, insects will come by, they will lay eggs, dust will go in, water will go in. An open track also meant that one could get electrocuted because of the exposure to an open circuit. So here was where Ubik made their difference. We have patented this, what we think is ultra safe, where we have modular stainless steel springs. They block the entrance. And so nobody can access the inside without first touching this stainless steel spring. And it's safe enough even really, for kids to, to stick a finger inside. There's no chance of getting that big shot. So this would be our biggest breakthrough. After designing the track, the team had to overcome yet another challenge. How to design a built-in switch that is working in sequence with the action of the engagement. The result of what you see now, it took us years to try and we we'll call mold something that has intricate contacts inside, all within one process, and spaced out so electrically they're all separated. Their system may look simple in design, but it took them 10 years to turn idea into reality. Over at Ubik, the design team are working on future developments. Data transmission and multimedia connectors along their power tracks, and even ambient lighting. This is our latest baby. It's called the Cobra. It's easy to move around as a unique 360 degree ball joint, the first of its kind in the world, and touch on off, dimming. The lamp head has a natural cooling. The vents you see here, they liken to the head of a cobra with a unique pattern. Now it allows the, the heat that is built up to naturally uh, cool down without any mechanism. From hotels to kitchens to offices, Ubik is closely working with companies to deliver the power they need in a stylish way that is also green and will ultimately save costs. We get a job done using less energy uh, from installation to the actual material and to providing a system that is fully ready for the future. We put in the system today, uh, after 10, 20 years, this system is just as good. In fact, when our clients or uh, the building is torn down, the products are 100% reusable. There are very few things more counterproductive than a badly designed workplace. And our design superheroes are deeply aware of that. Their designs are changing the way we work and how we work. In turn, raising productivity and making the workplace that bit more exciting.